I wanted to film a little a day in the life of a ballerina for you guys today. I haven't filmed one of these in a while. I'm trying to get back into the groove of things. I love making this type of content. I know you guys do too. So I just woke up a couple hours ago and I rented out a studio to go kind of just teach myself a little private. I have found for me, I'm a very logical person. I'm very Capricorn, I'm scheduled. I'm writing down my master plan <laughs> for my life. No, I'm basically gonna write down all ballet content that I want to shoot today and just for the rest of the month because I have to film reels and I have to film TikToks and I have to do all this stuff and like get back in my groove. I think for a while I took a little bit of a break because I just felt so forced and it didn't feel like something I wanted to do and I feel like jobs can happen like that but especially when it's like your image that's your job it's like so hard. I know I can always talk to you guys, my my YouTube friends, whoever is still here watching. I know you're a real one. Cue music. Fuck. <laughs> Cue music. <laughs> Perfect. a little bar on flat um, just to warm up a little bit but I have brand new shoes um, I wear freed classics five and a half single X normally star maker if they have it but I just started wearing size six just want to see how these look and feel also I haven't danced in a while so they look pretty good too let's try them out Great. Like I'm right back where I was like three or four years ago having my mental breakdown after my variation but I'm stronger now I can't just come and do point and do a full class and not be where I was like I haven't done a full class in like maybe months let alone just play around like this so it's like a muscle we know that I have it it's there but it needs to be trained so I'm gonna make a commitment to myself to come every week at least. I think I'm gonna sign up for the yearly class with all the young students again. Put myself back into class because I love it. I just wanna be back where I was. Like it frustrates me that I can't do what I did. And yeah, that's that. <laughs> We're okay. My final verdict on these shoes is that they're way too big. 
and I'm definitely a five and a half. I'm gonna sit in my little calm space and talk to you guys for a second because I love to talk about my mental health on here and I need advice. I have just been dealing with the worst anxiety ever. I've dealt with anxiety and I've been on medication for it before and I'm really trying this year to find natural remedies and I'm dealing with something new right now which is like intense like anxiety attacks I've had this skin condition for a while that no d doctor can figure out and it goes on and off and on and off and I get rashes all over my face all the time and the only answer for that is just stress so that's been raging right now and then I went into Trader Joe's the other day Trader Joe's Target any of those stores used to be my absolute therapy because it got me out of the house I was independent like so I go into this new Trader Joe's in my neighborhood and then and I literally have the most anxiety ever I have no idea what I came to get I'm stressing everyone's just trying to maneuver around me and like got whatever and then I got to the register and the guy at the register was like, oh, like, did you hear what happened to Anne Heche? Like, they should have done something to stop her and doing drugs and all her family and blah, 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 all this stuff. Like, and then he's like, well, have you been hearing what's going around in the area? There's so many break-ins in every house, so, like, be careful. It's not gonna stop. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? Like, it sent me into a full panic and just depressed, like, stage. I've never felt like that. I had to literally go to my car and sit in my car for 30 minutes, closing my eyes and breathing. The worst part about it was like, I felt like I was going to faint the whole time or that I was completely dissociating like out of body. That happened. And then today at Target, I felt the same way. <sighs> so I don't know what I'm going to do right now. I just want to be alone and I want to be in a clean space and just be independent, cook, do something to take care of myself. I've also noticed my eating patterns are so off. I'm just too anxious that I don't even think about food. I have zero appetite and I'll go like full days until like five o'clock and I'm like, oh my God, I didn't eat today. That rarely ever happens to me, especially because you guys know I've struggled so much with food. Like my, my sick twisted brain is like, wow, that's great. I didn't eat and I didn't even have to like struggle. Like, oh my God, I'm gonna be skinny. Like, which we can't get back into that pattern, you know? It's all just too much for me right now. Let's have a nice calming night like we used to together. I'm trying to maintain my natural curl and like style it right with good products. So it's my new favorite brand. As you can see, it's called Shea Moisture. And you're supposed to crunch it in with sopping wet hair. Perfect. I feel much better now. I am so hungry right now. I have zero groceries, but luckily this video is actually sponsored by HelloFresh and it could not be more convenient and it's actually something that I'm obsessed with and love. I'm so excited to talk about it. Today, we received this big old box. I already opened it and they send you pre-packaged little meal kits that you can cook on your own and they send you everything that you need for it so you're not wasting with very detailed instructions because, you know, some of us aren't the best chefs. I love HelloFresh because the recipes are simple, but they're also so delicious and healthy. HelloFresh allows you to customize your box exactly to your liking. So you can swap out a protein or a side for another, upgrading for a more luxurious experience. That means more choices, more variety, and more meals truly tailored exactly to your liking. As you guys know, I was just talking about earlier how the grocery store just ain't it for me anymore. It stresses me out. The idea of shopping for a meal, using everything that I buy, it just stresses me out. So I get to skip the grocery store and just spend more time on me. HelloFresh actually cuts down on your food waste by at least 25% compared to grocery store shopping. They also offer veggie, pescatarian, fit, and wholesome meals to make it easy to 
stick to your personal goals. As for me, I chose the meat option box, so I got three recipes. I'm gonna choose one from the mix tonight. Crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlets. One pan pork fajita lettuce wraps. I think this is what we have to make. And then we got meatballs with bulgogi sauce, bulgogi, which also looks so good. So you guys can go to hellofresh.com and use code LUNAMONTANA16 for 16 free meals across seven different boxes and three free gifts. That sounds like a deal to me. Done cooking now. It looks insane, as you can see. Thank you, HelloFresh, for providing my dinner. Mmm. Mmm. I know this is sponsored, but my reaction is not. <laughs> I'm going to go enjoy this now and watch some Sex in the City, but but again, you can go to HelloFresh.com and use my code LunaMontana16 for 16 free meals. Mm -mm -mm. I'm watching the new Sex in the City finally. It's just not living up to my expectations. I ate six lettuce wraps, which is fine. My body just needed that bad. I'm doing my nuka, honey, because I know it's good for your throat. I'm gonna make my tea and watch my show.